Bruh. What's going on, guys? The Inhuman Beat down here. This is just a quick update. Oh, God. Oh, that's funny. Okay, anyways, the point of this update is... I'm sure by now, someone... A lot of people have heard of the Nintendo joining with uh, or partnering with YouTube and putting ads in anything that is related to their videos, basically claiming it as theirs. Did I already finish that one? No, I have to do that one and that one. Okay. Uh, no doubt this will make it hard for people such as myself who make revenue off of this. I know they tried it with one of my Super Mario 64 Star Challenges. It's nothing better than basically having a quote from the people I'm partnered with that allow me to just basically tell them to go fuck off. Um, but I'll explain that in a second. Uh, for all of you out there that do Let's Plays and want to know that... Um, the irony of this is that I haven't had much trouble with Nintendo. Most of mine have been coming from past recordings that I did before I before I entered into a sort of high definition viewing course. Some of you may remember my really shitty recordings of when I was actually just using my camera on my phone to record Let's Plays. My original four, the Arkham City, Dante's Inferno, Brutal Legend and Operation Raccoon City. Uh, I'm going having to go back and freaking dispute legal things about the freaking original score in the game. Yes. And by that I mean the music that comes in the game. You know, that stuff you hear in the background. I'm being flagged for that. And it's just absolute crap. In other news, um, I'm not sure if a lot of you have seen it, but my uh, I took Little Karibos, uh season three of his Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged and cut it into pieces as sort of a, um, for those of you who have played Resident Evil 4, the separate ways that had um, Ada in it and how she moved along, I took mine and... Or I took this and made it as sort of a what was Melvin doing when everyone was happening. Even though it did appear in the series, I thought it would be a nice little thing just to have it all cut together because they were some of my favorite parts. This has previously gotten me a copyright strike that I eventually defeated after deleting the video and then uh, re-uploading it again. Much to my dismay. But now I've received another copyright strike from it again. I'm starting to understand why Little Karibo gets banned every other week. Anyways, in my fit of just not wanting to deal with it anymore, uh, give me a minute. I, I'm typing up disputes at the same time of recording this. <laughs> Uh, but I've just decided to, whoops, I've decided to just completely delete the video from my account, and I may go and upload it on my backup account that I use, maybe, maybe, I'm just kind of fed up with it at this point, because the people I'm partnered with right now, the uh, the guys over at zoomin.tv, uh, as they don't want to be associated with anyone that has copyright strikes on them, if I don't resolve this soon, I'll be dropped from it. And I'd really rather not. I like the idea of making money off of what I enjoy doing. And it was nice of them to send me an invite and you know give me the opportunity to join with them. And so I really want to keep that. So I'm trying to dispute the uh, thing right now. I've deleted it from my account. I'm going back and taking care of older videos to try and get the rights on them. Some of them are just stupid as all hell. This has the original score from this game. Really, you don't say. It might have something it might have to do with the fact that the score is in the game. Ugh. But 
in coming to do this, I have realized another thing that I was stupid in doing. I don't know how many of you have watched my Brutal Legend Let's Play or have played the game, but it features a lot of music. I mean, a lot of music. Uh, and when I mean a lot, I mean it has like actual artists and such Ozzy Osbourne, Def Leppard, and all of them. And it was looking back on it now and back then, it was just the stupidest thing to do. I've been slapped with so many like it's not copyright strikes, but it's those uh, what is it, third party content crap that you get that basically say oh hey you know we're not gonna take this video down but you can't do anything with it yeah oh god yeah I can't do anything with those can't do anything with those and it's just real annoying oh but yeah that's that's my update for now um but anyways, um, I was going to talk about, all right, I remember I was going to say what the thing was. Um, for all of you out there that are Let's Playing and do have this problem of, you know, you get either the third party content things or the, uh, you get your video just completely removed and copyrighted. Um, this is what my, the people over at TV sent me or sent all of us in its little knit community. It's a to learn about the strikes but its main thing was capturing your own game the one you played is part of the fair use policy that's used by YouTube and justified by law so long as you played the game and nothing else was added to it and it's just part of the game you have the right to post it just keep that in mind oh so I'm gonna wait see how this all blows over Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Oh, man. I just remembered. Oh, fuck. Oh, with that copyright strike on here, I can't upload videos past 15 minutes again. Okay. This has become another segment. Uh, so, my games are going to apparently take a pause now, because I didn't see... Because I didn't think about that one till now um so my upload schedule will be taking a pause until this is resolved so yeah until whenever guys i will catch you later hasta huck